guys welcome back today is thursday so <gasps> it is october 1st oh my god i love october october is my favorite one of my favorite months obviously i just love kids dressing up and trick-or-treating because i love dressing up and trick-or-treating but also when you're an adult like you give out candy i realized that as an adult you can choose what candy to give and so there was always these like houses that would have king size snickers and all of these candies so i want to be that house um but that is why it's so exciting to me and aside from that like all the trees start dying unfortunately but it looks really pretty because the leaves start turning colors and falling so that is exciting i it's october 1st rent is due today um what else i have quite a few things to do today but first and foremost i'm going to do breakfast um the kids are outside honestly ozo and chai spend 80 percent of their day outside that's just their thing without rambling i feel like i haven't caught up with you guys in a long time so that's what i'm not trying to do but my breakfast today is going to be just these vans blueberry waffles they are protein waffles and they are also dairy and egg free which is always a plus I also try to chug at least one water bottle before I eat anything in the morning. I'm going to use this Aunt Jemima original syrup, but this is light, so it has 50% fewer calories. I don't use a lot of syrup on the blueberry waffles because they're already sweet because of the blueberries, but I like to have like a little syrup just to make them not too dry. Hi, girl. Hey, girl. <laughs> Hi, I don't have any treats for you, girl. I don't have no treats for you, mama. Oh, hello, Mr. Boy. So as I eat my breakfast, I like to sit in my little corner and reply to emails. So today is an important day, actually, because um, in my calendar, I haven't filled out all of October yet. But today, um, I have the live stream with Padres Jóvenes Unidos. So this is going to be a live stream on their Facebook page. By the time you see this, it would have already happened. But it's basically them introducing our barrio votes um, and we're just trying to get the latinx community that is able to vote to go out and vote because we need to let them know that their voice counts their voice matters um also i have to reply to my managers um and i have to pay out an invoice for them and also i am coming out with a new uh merch design for october and i just got one of the drafts um sent to me like they just drafted up the graphic and it is so cute i'm so excited um i have to make some changes to it but i really like it so far okay perfect so i'm gonna eat my breakfast i'm going to reply to all these emails and then i'll be back with you guys are you guys tired of being outside or what or did you smell food i think you smelled food girl oh i love you I've been doing work for about an hour already. I just got back to all the emails I need to get back to and I'm filling out my October calendar, but I just got an email that my Amazon package was delivered and I'm so excited because I ordered everything that I need to make a matcha latte at home. I'm gonna eat some lunch in a little bit and then my little dessert for the day, like little pick me up is going to be a matcha latte. I'm so excited, but let me show you guys the kids. Chai always sleeps on this side unless she's cuddled to Ozo. And Ozo sleeps on this side. Okay, let's look at my package. I just got it. I'm so excited. I ordered this Encha Latte Grade um, First Harvest Pure Organic Matcha. Then I ordered the Authentic Matcha Set. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. I got a spoon, a scoop, and a whisk. I decided to get... Oh, shit. These are so thick. <laughs> um, it comes with a little brush to clean them. I thought they were going to be thinner, but I got really thick ones. I got thick reusable straws, or glass reusable straws. Strainers. So, obviously, they only use this little one but i saw a pack of three that was 9.99 so i just got it for the little matcha i ordered also a milk frother because they do froth their matcha sometimes to make it foamy i love that so i got a milk frother i got the cups that kristen was using they um are these little cups this is the one she used so basically they're just jars 
but she uses them as cups so they're these thicky cups i'm going to try it out in a little bit well, i'm gonna attempt to make it in a little bit i just have um let me see if i have any emails so i pretty much responded to all the emails i needed to respond to i am planning a trip right now uh yesterday i actually booked our flights for arizona we're going the 24th of this month through the 27th so I just wrote it in our calendar and then i need i'm actually planning another trip for november which is a very exciting trip oh, i'm so excited and i also have two what do i have to what else do i have to do today i have to start getting ready by like 2 p.m so i can get out of the house by 4 p.m so i can get to denver by 5 p.m so i can set get everything set up let me show you guys the kids again because they are now cuddled so yesterday i made carne con chile verde and rice and usually i usually make enough for jonathan's lunch and then for my lunch too so i'm going to heat it up here is what i made for dinner last night just arroz rojo con carne y papas con chile verde it is a 107 and i was about to make my lacha mate my lacha mate my matcha latte but i went to my fridge and realized i had no milk <laughs> so i'm headed to safeway to get milk so a little update is that chai can be alone for i would say like 30 minutes with ozo because they just nap i think since ozo has been so well trained in being home alone for a while he knows that like all he does is sleep when we're not home um so i think since he is already trained in that way when we leave he knows like instinct yeah like they're gone i'm gonna go nap so uh, i think he's just been implementing a lot of his training skills into chai um so chai is becoming more like ozo which is amazing honestly i love both of them so much they are a handful i'm not gonna lie it is stressful <laughs> back from getting my um almond, almond milk my oat milk and i have everything set up actually hold on should i just wa re watch kristen's um igtv video so i could write down what i needed to do it's very simple but i just like to have everything written down so i get one tablespoon of matcha powder no one teaspoon i get hot water And I use my little matcha whisk and so I'm gonna add a little bit of vanilla to the matcha. And we will use this little scoop. Oh my gosh, this is so cute! This is the moment of truth. <laughs> Let me get my straw. My little huge, thicky straw. Ozo <laughs> always sits here because this is where I make my smoothies usually. And I use peanut butter and banana, so I always give them those treats. But I'm nervous. Okay. <sighs> Whoa! <gasps> it is so good. I think um, the oat milk is a little bit overpowering, but it is so good. I think next time I'm just going to use regular lactate milk. Um, because i think the milk is just a little bit overpowering all right i'm gonna start getting ready um it is two and i just want to be ready beforehand i just don't want to be rushed and i have to take my ring light and i have to clean out my car because it's so messy so i have a lot of things to do before i leave so i'm just gonna get ready get that out of the way and then i'll be back 
I am done doing my makeup. I am gonna do my hair in a little bit, but I came downstairs for a snack. Also to let the dogs out. They had taken a nap, so now they are outside wrestling like always. But I'm just gonna eat some uh, an apple with tahin. Oh, I literally, my mouth is watering. Oh my God. The first bite. There's a script that I had to semi-memorize. We're gonna have a teleprompter and also some um, note cards, but I am so nervous. I've never had to do this before, so wish me luck. If you guys, you guys would have already seen it if you tuned into my YouTube channel, but don't tell me how I did because I'm nervous and I probably did bad, but I'm gonna eat my, my, I'm gonna eat my snack outside with the kids and then we'll do a hair. Going to do my hair in a bit still. But I got a Fashion Nova package in. Um, I love their jeans. So I got two. <laughs> and I don't know if they're going to fit me because... Uh, so when I went to LA in December for Lulu's birthday, we went to the mall and I got some jeans there. And they were a size 15, which is not usually my size, but I like them baggy. And I did gain a little weight. So I thought since we went to the Fashion Nova at the mall and I got jeans that were size 15 and they fit me perfect, I'm going to do the same. I'm going to order the same size. <sighs> oh, I think these are too... Oh, shit. <laughs> they're too big. Fudge. I think Fashion Nova jean size is just... Very They just fit me So baggy Fit just a little loose Not even too much <sighs> I think I messed up They are so baggy They honestly kind of fit me from my waist But from like From everywhere else they're baggy I actually kind of vibe with them though They're perfect um, I think I'm gonna just keep them actually. Um, they're so baggy, but they even make my butt look non existent. Okay, here are the black ones. I went ahead and did the hack that everyone does and like put the little button through another one. They don't look too bad, <laughs> but they're huge. I don't know, maybe I'll wear them, maybe I won't. I'm headed out, the time is getting closer. I have my Chingo La Migra shirt on and Jonathan is literally 10 minutes away so I'm just leaving the dogs alone for 10 minutes me trying to justify not being a good me trying to justify being a good mom but I'm nervous I got my water all right let's get there safe I made it to Denver with Alejandro she didn't crash I didn't crash I got you a birthday present were you really yeah who Thank do you, you think I am? Hi. Good, how are you? Which one is that one? No, this one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you, the camera. <laughs> oh, thank you. Oh, Wait, what is it? It's, that's just the box. <laughs> You're like, what it's inside is different. Yeah. You're like, don't get too excited. Ah, uh, all the makeup. Uh, <laughs> Oh, thank you, because I do need it. <laughs> yeah. That's cute. Thank you. Of I'm not going to lose this one. Okay. Yeah, you better not. A little story time last year. <laughs> <laughs> he invited us to his birthday brunch, and he got so drunk that he lost all the presents, so he lost my present last I didn't year. get drunk. I fell asleep on the table. <laughs> you were right, because you were <laughs> drunk. But anyways, I need to go over my lines, man. I, I am not here by myself. I am accompanied by a special guest and big time supporter, BAU. Please welcome to your screen, Blanca. Bye. <laughs> put on, put on. Uh, my name is Blanca, I am 22 years old and Mexicana. I use her, ella pronouns and I am documented. And, no? Yes. And this year I am excited to educate our Gen Z and millennial voters on why this election is extremely important. I got into this work because I want everyone that is able to vote to do so and who is not to realize that their voice also matters. Thank you for sharing your story with us. Which means this year we do not have an excuse to not mobilize our family, friends, or community. And before we continue with our program, para las personas que hablan español, este en vivo está disponible en su idioma. Marque el número de teléfono en pantalla para tener interpretación simultánea. If you are not yet convinced of why you should make a donation tonight or join as a volunteer, I invite you to hear from our next speaker. She is an alumni from Padres y Jóvenes Unidos, a woman of color, a daughter of immigrant parents, and she is excited to see to share with you our 
our Barrio Votes 2020 issue priorities. Please welcome to your screen, Abby Munoz. The video goes live. Thank you, Abby, for sharing with us about PU's issue priority. <sighs> we finished our live. First of all, I didn't even go live on YouTube, did it? <laughs> no, no, because it did a security. Uh, it said that we had to wait 24 hours for them to allow us <sighs> to live stream. We should have done it yesterday. Wait, can you close your account on your computer? Oh, yeah. We're done, and this is how it went. <laughs> we were about to just shut everything down. <laughs> it was stressful. I applaud you guys for your work, but I would have already quit, honestly. Got the cash double double like it's in and out Got a flash in me new trunk cause we slipping out Going stupid in the car and we drifting out Homies in the trunk and we bobbing as we flipping out Hey, going fast now we lane switch We ain't that big but we acting like we famous 